what up guys and I apologize for the last video if it you can't see the type I swear I uploaded it in HD I swear I did but for me it's not looking like it's in HD and it may not be for you anyway let's just get into this definitely making good progress you've also learned when why we use HTML we've also learned how to set up HTML files with tags title yeah mm-hmm Next up is give our paragraphs headings using head tags. Let's start the H1 tag. What? In the body? Okay, so we have to find the body. This is the body. H1. So we have to use H1. Add content. Dusty. Um, dusty. That's not what I wanted to do. Closure with closing tag. So to close something, it seems like you do a slash and then whatever the opening tag was. Um, yeah, underneath the heading, create two paragraphs using P, okay, so, so we'll do, um, P, um, and then we'll just close it, and then we'll open it again, and slash P, so that's cool, that you can definitely see that the title is a lot bigger. So, awesome. Uh, my mic. I've listened to my videos. And so I, I know that sometimes my mic dips out. HTML actually lets us have more than one heading size. There are six heading sizes where H1 is the boss and H6 is puny. H6 gets, that's my job. Below, your code currently has H1. Add H3 heading before the second paragraph. So, I guess we're going to do H3, and then I'll do, ha ha ha, because, you know, it's it's smaller, but, I mean, why not? And then we'll do slash H3 to close it. Awesome. Um, add an H5 after the second paragraph, then add a third paragraph after this heading. So, I guess we'll do H5. And then we'll close this H5. And as you can see, the size is getting bigger. Then it wants us to add another paragraph. So we'll just add a paragraph. Awesome. Looks, looks good. Looks fantastic. Given that there are six heading sizes, together we should make use of all six. Add three more headings to the code. Make sure H2, H4, and H6. Make sure to close all your tags under each heading. Add a short, short paragraph. Don't forget paragraphs need to open. Okay, so we'll do H2. You know, lol. Actually, we'll just do A's to speed this up. And then it wants us to add these. And we'll just close it. And then we need to do H4. A. And then we'll close H4, and we'll just do P A. Um, slash P. Wow, how did I not? Okay, and then we'll do H6 A. Slash H6, and then P A. And then we'll close that. I mean, this this really isn't that harsh. Just memorizing stuff. Look. So as you can see, it kind of gets smaller. I mean, so yeah, congratulations, you finished this section. Awesome. Mid-lesson breather. Okay, even on a quick hit summary of what we learned. Yep. Add a title between the title tags. Well, the title is here, so I mean, the title is going to be la 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 because that's that's the title create h3 sized create an h3 sized heading in the body make sure your heading says anything you want where's your body okay create three paragraphs the little content yeah, we already had that. Awesome. You're going places. What if you want to send 
use it to another part of the website or another site. Okay, I'll use hyperlinks or short links. The first is opening, um, opening a tag, and that tag has an attribute called H. Uh, I don't even see what this is. Anyway, H R E F. Oh, I see it's right here. Wow, I'm an idiot. The H R E F tells where you want to go. In this case, there. Then you have description of your link. Says my favorite. Awesome. Finally, you have your closing tags. In the uh, by section, to do this, create an A tag. Um, value H R E F equals um, add a description. Point your link to the website. Okay, so we have to go find it. We'll just use this link. The link it provides us. Hey, give me no. Give me that. Control C. Control V. Awesome. Let's hope this works. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Add a description of your link. I am here. Lol. And then close it. Slash A. Slash A. Um, well, let's hope this works. Yeah. Awesome. So. Oh, it actually makes. Okay, I see what it does. It makes. I am here. Lol. If you click that, it will. T it'll take us to codecademy.com. Which is pretty cool. Um, thanks for watching. Next, we're gonna learn about rubber duckies. Images. Awesome, I guess.